Oh, there it goes. Oh my God, I did it. Oh my God. Woo, that looks good. Okay, wait, what? That's kind of crazy. So you're telling me. So what you're telling, I'm making so many discoveries right now. When I don't know what to do with something, I'm just like cover it up with, I don't know, a tree. Boom, problem freaking solved. <laughs> Hey y'all, look at my spooky little setup I got going on here. Look, I got gamer girl lights. I'm officially a gamer girl. Thank you for welcoming me in. So today we're going to be building another shaped house, if that makes any sense. But I'm gonna be building it in the shape of a triangle. And instead of doing it like 2D triangle, I'm gonna try to do 3D triangle. Wish me luck, I feel like this is gonna go really poorly. <laughs> so there's another word for this. I believe it's called an A-frame house where it's like the roof goes to like the floor. The house will kind of look like this. That's what it's gonna try to, I'm gonna attempt to do this. So I think I'm gonna try to make it two stories. It's gonna be really small though. It's gonna be really small. I have no idea if this is gonna work. I have no idea. That feels big, but when you go on the inside, it's really not that big. For scale, here's a bed that takes up half the space. So we're gonna have to use our space wisely. But I looked up a tutorial on how to do this because your girl did not know how. And it's really quite tricky. So let's see if I can remember. So you gotta make it really tiny. So we're gonna make it like super skinny legend. Bring that in. Okay, that looks good. That looks good. I'd like to do some glass too, because I feel like that could be really fancy. Bring that in. Okay. I think so far so good if I'm doing it right. I have no idea. It's gonna be a surprise in the end. I think so far so good. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do on the top, but let's just copy and paste this and move it over. My plan for this is to put like glass or something, but I gotta make it. Oh, there it goes. Oh my God, I did it. Oh my God. God! Woo, that looks good. Okay, this is gonna be big. Okay, so I could do the roof really easily by just doing this. I feel like this is the easy route. Does that look off to you? Does that look like a triangle to you? Or does that look kind of like it's going that? And it goes <laughs> I feel like it goes out a little bit. Maybe it's just my eyes playing tricks on me. Oh, that's better. That's better. It was, it was my fault. So that's my typical triangle. Now, if I want to put glass up here, I feel like it does start looking a little bit weird. So I can bring this back and kind of do the same thing I did on the first level, right? And then bring this here and move it across and then make it glass. I mean, it kind of works, but then you have this big hole that I don't know how to get rid of. Why is there a hole? <laughs> oh my God. I wonder what would happen if I like put another one of these roofs on here but made it like slightly smaller and then brought it across. Is this stupid? Yeah, that doesn't work. So that's the only issue. I don't know how to ex fix that exactly. I could try to do this. Okay, well, there's not a hole anymore, but now there's just like, you can see the roof. I don't exactly know how to fix that problem. I'm not smart enough. <laughs> but I mean, did I make a triangle? I did, you can't deny that. What if I made this glass on just the top? Could do that too. It looks like it's wearing a little hat. <laughs> I think I'll keep it like that. I'm pretty proud of that. And then, oh, uh, the floor plan. Wait, can I put things on the roof? Hold on. We're gonna try to put a little plant up here and just see what happens. I can put things in there. <gasps> Does that mean that if I put a ladder down, your Sims can hang out there and it's like a skylight? <gasps> I'm trying that. First, let's put a trim on the roof. That looks good. If I put a ladder, I guess in here. Ooh, the ladder would have to be like in the middle of the room. But yeah, you could technically go up there. Oh, that's sick though. Where, hold on. So I can put one like right against the wall, but where is it going up to? Can I delete this wall? Dang it, can I put a door? Shut your mouth. <gasps> what? I could put a door there? Wait, what? That's kind of crazy. So you're telling me. So what you're telling, I'm making so many discoveries right now. I can put a door there and you basically go through the crawl space. Can they even get there? I'm gonna have to test this out. <laughs> I have no idea. This is kind of crazy. Okay, let's try to give it some like wallpaper and stuff and then work on the outside before we get all crazy on the inside. But this has truly inspired me. Okay, so I'm thinking like a light brown. It's like very modern and cool. Um, now for the fr Oh wait, I didn't think about windows. Mm. Do you think I could make like this whole wall windows inside? Oh my God, I could put windows there. So technically I could put doors here and they could walk around here. It could be like a little plant garden. This just opened up a whole new can of worms. So I could just do windows, you know, I could technically, or I could put a door and they can come out here and do things like it's a little yard. I just realized how that looks. It doesn't look good guys. It does not look good. <laughs> Oh no. And I can't even put a window here. Oop, now I can. <laughs> you just see the ladder. <laughs> 
could always use my favorite window. Hold on, hold on. This sweet little angel right here. I do love this window. Let's see what it looks like if I replace these with that. It looks weird. You know, the whole thing just looks really funky. Just really funky. It's bizarre. It's very strange. I mean, I do kind of like the way it looks on the sides, but I feel like in the front and the back, it looks weird with windows, which I mean, that doesn't surprise me. The house is literally a triangle, but there should be windows, I feel like, because I feel like without it, it just looks naked. What? Wait a minute. What? Hmm. Do you think I could use these? I don't ever use like these windows ever. Maybe I could. Why? Are they so big? Hey, well, that looks kind of cool. Let's use these. Wait, no, 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 wait. I'm really into that. I think that looks really cool. Hey, that looks pretty cool though. But I don't know what to do on like this top level. You know, I feel like that looks pretty good. I'm enjoying the way that this looks. I think it looks cute. But then what? Because I feel like there's something missing right here. You know, what is it? What am I missing? What needs to go there? Because I feel like it's, it's empty. It needs something. I don't know if it needs a window. Is that window like too much? Does it look silly? I just don't know if it looks silly. I can't tell if it's like too, too many windows. I don't know when to stop. That's my problem. I guess I'm just gonna go with that. I still feel like maybe that's not the right way to go, but I don't really know what is. So if I put a little window box at the top, I feel a little bit better. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> oh, this is it. This is it, everyone. Is that the move? <laughs> Did I ruin it or does it look cute? Man, I can't tell. I do kind of like the flowers though. I feel like it gives it something, you know? I'm into the flowers. I think the flowers look really, really cute. I like it. I think it gives it something. Now, as far as these corners go, I think I'll just landscape and try to cover it up. That's always what I do anyways. When I don't know what to do with something, I'm just like cover it up with, I don't know, a tree. Boom, problem freaking solved. <laughs> I mean, kinda, you know? It does kind of solve the problem. We love that, honestly. We love a good tree. Should I, oh my God, wait, I love the way that that looks. Hold on. <gasps> oh, that looks really cute. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. I love that. Okay, what I'm thinking for like a little pathway, I am very happy with the stones that we got in the Star Wars pack. I'm telling you, it's literally the only thing I use from that pack. I could do something like that. And oh, you know what? No, 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 I have an idea. Mr. Krabs, I have an idea. I'm gonna put two plant pots right here. Boom, stunning. you love to see it. And then what I'm gonna do is along the pathway, I might need some landscaping, but I wanna put like little pathway lights. That looks super cute. I like that. This is the hardest part. I hate doing landscaping. Part of me hates it and part of me loves it at the same time. Okay, I think I'm gonna go with something like that. Maybe. Does that look weird? I'm keeping it. Nope, I, I'm just like that I'm done. <laughs> done with it. I'm gonna put some dirt around. Need something. Put some dirt around these trees. And I, I do think that the house could use a little bit of dirt around it, you know? You know, the old technique. Some people probably just think that this is a waste of time, but I feel like it does something. I don't know what, I just feel like it does something. Oh, we're gonna need trees back here. We have more corners to hide. But seeing as this is the backyard, that should be no problem. Put down some more dirt. Everybody get some dirt. <laughs> okay, I'm I'm liking this so far. This is looking cute. This is looking cute. I think now we just need like some flowers and stuff. Maybe some rocks. I don't know. There we go. That gives it something. <laughs> I don't know. I don't, at this point, I don't even know what I'm doing. Should I do flowers or should I just do like a bush? Like right next to the little planter. I like that. Oh, it needs a mailbox. Mail. Where's the mailbox gonna go? Ooh, didn't think about that. Maybe right there is fine. All right, as far as landscaping goes, I might be done. <sighs> Part of me, something in my soul is telling me, put hedges over there, hedges everywhere. You wanna know what I say to that? Say no more, I will do what you say. It's me, it's how I talk to my subconscious. It was worth it, I'm glad I listened. I'll put some in the back too, just so it's very, very cute. I'll leave this open. I feel like I should put a door there for like a backyard, you know? Oh, it's looking super cute on the inside. It's like nothing but windows, I'm, it's really cute. My problem with it is like, uh, is there gonna be a bathroom in here? <laughs> That's my issue. Cause I might have to put the bathroom like in the middle of the room or something. Like that might have to be the bathroom, you know? I feel like that might have to be it. Cause then there's only one window and not like giant windows. You you get me, right? So this is the part that I was literally stalling for. I like really didn't want to deal with this. What if I remove like the middle windows? Does that make it look ugly? Kinda. Let's give it some wallpaper and some flooring. Just keep it simple, you know? Just keep it simple. All right, so now I have to figure out how I'm gonna do like the kitchen and stuff. Yeah, I just have been stalling this. I just don't really, I really don't want to do it. I just know it's gonna be terrible. It's gonna be bad. I'm gonna have to, cause I'm gonna block windows. Like there's just literally no way around it. Uh, this is so hard. 
hard. I'm gonna have to block some windows. It's just gonna happen. We'll put a trash can over here. In the middle, we're gonna have to have the oven right here. It's up against the window. I know. I prefer not to do it, but it is what it is. And since we can't, I feel like cabinets above are gonna look super, super weird because it's definitely gonna be covering the windows. You know, you see what I'm saying? What I'm thinking we do instead is something that I almost always forget is in the game, but we have shelves in the game. Do you guys know this? Because I forgot. I feel like we could use these instead in between the windows. Oh, there is also this. Oh my God, that's so cute. Right above the trash can. <laughs> and I was thinking of just like putting flat shelves in here doing like one two and then just like putting crap on them sounds good to me actually i might do like a light wood color to match the floor that could be cute also there's no lights in here i was like it's a little dark <laughs> with all these windows i don't know what the floor plan is gonna be like up here but let's put that do i put lights up here i mean i guess at night we'll light it up okay fine well now the trick is trying to find things that fit on these shelves it's just not easy man it's really not easy out here trying to put things on shelves nothing fits oh i didn't do the island i was like wait i'm forgetting something i think because in my mind, a dining room is just not going to happen here. And then I'll put the kitchen sink just in the island. There we go. That's nice. All right. Now I'm going to try to put some stuff on these shelves. Wish me luck. It's not going to happen. I think I'm going to have to cheat. <laughs> I just don't think this is going to work. You're telling me I can't put those little incense there? Why? I'd like to put some plates and stuff up there, but I just don't think it's gonna happen. It does not want me to do that. And fit that up there, I guess. Maybe a little plant. Oh my God, a plant won't even fit up there. Oh, this one will. <laughs> I'm gonna have to put things like books up here. Like things that are normally not in kitchens. That's just, that's I, that's just what's gonna have to happen. There's no other choice. Oh, a cookie jar. That, that works. Happy to put a cookie jar up here. I'll fit a little cat. <laughs> That cat is huge. It's so much bigger than half the stuff. How come this can fit, but nothing else can? That doesn't make any sense. Here's some more utensils. <laughs> nothing but utensils up here. We have utensils for days. Maybe I can fit a candle, like a like a little baby. Oh, that, that thing's huge, actually. I didn't realize how big it was. I can fit these up there. Kinda. Oh, I can, fit, I can fit that one. Okay. Okay, now I just need like one more thing. Just one thing. I'm gonna put some pencils up there. Man, I just don't know what else to do. But there you go. The shelves have been filled. All right, so on this wall, got the cameras like a little bit funky in here. I'm not gonna lie. Be warned if you wanna live in a house like this. I mean, not in real life, <laughs> but in, in The Sims. Hey, I'm gonna stick the door over here in like the corner. And then in here, I'll make it a bathroom. It'll probably be the only bathroom, but hey, this house isn't that big. Oh, shoot. I forgot a ladder. <laughs> Oopsies. Okay, I'll stick the ladder there. Upstairs is a little bit strange. There's a ladder here and there's also a ladder over here. I know this isn't centered, but it can't be because otherwise then you can't get to this little door. I'm really hoping that I can use that space up there and that this isn't a total waste of time. But let's make a bathroom. Oh, it's gonna have to be like a full bathroom. I hope this is enough room. You know what? I can make this work. We'll do like one of these here. Oh shoot, that's not enough room. <sighs> Use your imagination, use your imagination. Oh my God, this is so bad, so bad. I can move the door over, but it doesn't help me much because <laughs> I still need a sink. You know, how about this? I think, I think this is functional. I'm pretty sure this is functional because I think all you need is like this front space to be able to get into a bathtub. I think, don't quote me on that. I could be wrong, but you know, there's a bathroom. Here's a towel Again, this camera angle, a little funky. And uh, here's another towel, boop. There you go. Done. That was easy. Now we can put stuff on the outside of it. What should we put out here? How about we put a little linen closet right here? Like on the outside of the bathroom? Because it doesn't fit in the bathroom, right? So like, what if we just stuck it outside the bathroom? We love functionality, sweetheart. We love it. So over here... Listen, not a ton of space, but I guess we could make it like a little nook, like a little reading area, sitting space, something maybe. Oh, now I have a better idea. How about we make it the world's tiniest office? How cute is that? Look at that, a little office space. I think that's super cute and cozy. Thank you, thank you for listening. I think I'm gonna replace that painting with this like wall of plants because it's freaking beautiful <laughs> and I forgot it existed. So how about we just put that there and then over here we put a painting. I like that idea. There we go, cute, 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 and I, believe that's everything for downstairs. So we have a kitchen area, a place to sit down and eat, um, an office and a bathroom. Man, I used it. I think I did pretty good for that space because upstairs will be like a bedroom and a living space. And that's it. So it'll basically be like one big loft bedroom with like a little sitting area. That's my that's my plan. Uh, let's see if I can make it work. Okay, I think this is where I'm gonna put the bed. God, this room is very big. So we'll have enough room to do so many fun activities in here. Like sit and sleep and enjoy each other's company. Cause I assume there's only gonna be two people in this house. Good luck if they have kids, not my problem.
<laughs> you think this rug is big enough? <laughs> Maybe we tone it down a little bit. Just, just a smidge. Let's get an ottoman. We could put an ottoman or a whole ass couch. I think I'll just do an ottoman. We'll put the couch over here. Oh, I do want a TV though. We're gonna put the couch here. Hear me out. I'm gonna put the TV on there. Man, we need some new couches. I'm, I'm getting like real sick of all these couches. I use them all the time. I'm sick of looking at them, you know? Is this like too much beige? This is a lot of beige. But beige like works in this room for some reason, so I keep going back. <gasps> that is so cute and it matches the bed so well. Oh, that's cute. Okay, let's get a chair. You know what? That looks cute. That looks cute. Let's get a rug and like a, oh, this is gonna be too many rugs. We're gonna have to get a small rug. A baby. Maybe it should be a solid color. I know that's kind of boring, but we already have a lot of patterns happening. Maybe that's what we need. I don't know if there is any solid, oh, there's some, I mean, there are some solid colors. They're not great though. This is gonna take me a minute to find one. Oh my God, I'm finding everything but solid colors. Oh, that's cute. Like a little fuzzy rug. I like that. We need like the world's smallest coffee table. I mean, tiny, tiny, tiny. I might use an outdoor table, like a really, really tiny baby. This could work. We can make that work, okay. And, oh, oh, and let's get the candle thing. Stunning. Freaking stunning. I like it. I think that's super cute. I'm trying to decide if I want to put it like a little end table here. I don't know if it'll be too much. Oh, it's kind of glitchy with the uh, the sides of this couch. Not that I would use that anyways, but uh, no, maybe I shouldn't. You know what? No, I'll just put a plant there. When in doubt, put a plant. Put one over there. And then right here we'll put, what's gonna be a good plant? I need like a good size plant. Maybe this little guy. They're kind of cute. Or even this little guy. Ooh, fancy, fancy, fancy. Okay, I like it, I like it. This thing's bouncing all over the place. Sorry, it's making me dizzy. Let's give them some hobbies. I think we should put like an easel in here somewhere, maybe in the corner. And then maybe a chess table. We have room for that. We have a lot of different wood tones happening in this room. Consider it an experiment. <laughs> Okay, this is the cutest space. I would die if I lived here. It would just be so cute. Like, you, there are your beds right here, and then you have, like, a cute little, like, a living room space in your bedroom. That is adorable. That is so cute. Think of how cozy that would be at night. You know what? Let's just make it nighttime. Damn cozy. I like it. I'm really into it. Okay. So upstairs, I was going to put like a little seating area up here, but now I don't know if I need to, you know? Do you think I can fence this off? Interesting. It does stick out though. <laughs> so I was going to try to put like a little border. Oh, that looks really good. Ooh, that looks cute. If I like removed this, it would look a million times better in here. I think I might just remove it, guys. I think I don't really need this up here. I didn't realize that the upstairs was gonna be so cute. I thought I wasn't gonna have enough space. So I was like, oh yeah, the, the upstairs would be like a hangout space. But this ended up being way better than I thought. So I'm actually pretty pleased with this. I don't really feel like I need the extra space anymore. But we have a full bathroom down here, an office space, a kitchen. We don't have a dining room, but I mean like we have places to sit and eat. I'm pretty satisfied with this little cute house. I think it's super cute. You know what I'm gonna save? I don't wanna lose this baby. I am so proud of this. So this is the first time I've done like a 3D shape, right? I usually do them like 2D on the ground and then just try to make a house out of that. But I thought a triangle we can do because I've seen this done before. And I think I did a pretty good job. I'm pretty proud of it. I still don't know about the window situation. I did my best. I did my best. Don't judge me. But you know what? I tried. It's my first time doing it. I'm pretty happy with it. I didn't do a backyard. I got a little lazy. Not gonna lie, but whatever. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. And if you have any other ideas for what I should try to build, comment them down below. To become part of the early squad, click that notification bell and make sure all notifications are on so you never miss any of my videos. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I'll speak to you all very, very soon. Bye-bye.